so we're back and here's the recap uh, what we did find in the jar was we found some uh, plain pieces here's uh, demonstrates the various sizes got a whole jar full of them uh, we also had some little uh, steel balls I have no idea what they were for just little ones you saw them so put that back in the jar a little washer of some kinds probably going back in the jar a chain I'll probably keep this chain just because it's huge I could use it for who knows what so it's not really a stout chain but for decorative use it did it, it come in pretty handy so, gonna keep that found two of these just little coin cases probably going back one of them at least is probably going back in a jar although they can come in handy for storing smaller parts I will give you tell you that all right found a how to key this is an old one got the magnet on the back that might could come in handy I think I have a brother of mine who wants that so that's where that's going found a pocket knife uh, without any blades which is sort of uneventful uh, it's a older one made in USA it's Imperial sort of sad because I love these old knives uh, I, I think I have owned a couple before I know uh, some of my brothers I think my dad owns a couple they're good knives sort of a shame that uh, the blades broke off either that's going in my collection of broke knives or that's going to go back into another jar so there's that I found a little keychain for a uh, I think it's some kind of uh, some kind of car service of some kind in North Carolina sort of uneventful going into the jar I found a chain I'm gonna keep the chain chains are always handy it's a pretty cool little brass jo uh, chain so that's pretty cool now going to some of my more favorite things so oh, also found some of these I have no idea what they are they're just little jewels them are going back in a jar for sure uh, go to the coins I have no idea what a luxury tax token is nor do I have any idea what Let's see if I can read this get this out of the camera so I can read it sales tax receipt is like this I did not know they did this but I have one for I actually have two for Missouri um, Oklahoma Alabama and this one's actually plastic and it is a sales tax token is Alabama that's pretty cool and here I have a no cash value coin it's pretty cool either they will go into I have a, a bag I keep junk coins that I might want to use on decorative items or something they either might either go there I'm gonna try to find out what these are this might just go back into a jar of some kind and that's what's so much fun about these jars and why I get them is it's so much fun to dig through them you have no idea until you try to how fun it is to dig through stuff you find little treasures and then you can sell them to people who enjoy it and add your own stuff and it's just it's a really cool little uh, community I really do enjoy it it's a lot of fun also found uh, these cufflinks these are two different pair of cufflinks that have been uh, debacked I guess is what you'd say it's sort of sad but I have a plan because normally these would have a smaller back on them that you could slip through and then you'd wear the cufflink like that and it'd look nice so I found this one pair of cufflinks that's really beautiful and they're old you got the pearl with the I mean they're worth something I'm sure but I'm gonna take these two and put them on the back of these so I have two pair of cufflinks and I can either wear these on the outside or these on the outside and they'll be matched pair thought that was pretty smart of me by the way so that's what I'm gonna do with them probably now we get to my favorite stuff uh, this I like this just because I have no idea what it is uh, I really do not know I tried to search it but I could not find out what it is either I'm gonna keep that just in my miscellaneous stuff or I'm very well might put that in another jar which would be pretty cool so that's what I'm gonna do with that this I really like this I'm gonna try to refurbish this this is a razor box cutter old box cutter 
And who carries one of them anymore, you know? So, you know, they'll be using their Gerbers, and I'll be using my really safe cutter. That's cool. So, just got a nice style about it. I really like that. I'm keeping that for sure. That's mine. Okay. This, my brother wanted to have a little uh, Captain Tactical. You know, he likes sports. This is the World Series 1999 pin. It's pretty cool. Atlanta's Braves lost 4-0. to So, dark day, but he wanted it. Now we get to the lighters that I found. And uh, I found three. Uh, first one. This, I've never seen another lighter like this. This is just made in USA, so I don't know who made it. Uh, has no name on the interior. Uh, it does have the spring and the screw, which is a plus. No flint, obviously. And I've never seen a spring system like this. Normally, they're like this one. Have this arm with a spring. But I've never seen this, so I might just keep this one, or I could sell it or put it in another jar. I haven't decided yet, but that's pretty cool. Had some kind of uh, advertisement, no doubt. Uh, this one is a electric lighter that I found. Hopefully, I can get it working. When you strike it, you do see a spark in there, and it's butane, obviously, and it's refillable. So maybe that'll work. And lastly, we have this one, which is a uh, leather-covered lighter. I have no idea who made it. It's a really cool lighter. I like it a lot. I'll probably keep this one just because it's leather-covered. And uh, so there we go. Now, we get to the really the best two items that I did find in the, the jar. I found these two rings, and they are really, really nice. Uh, both of them are stone. This one's green, obviously. And this one is like a tannish, maybe pink, I guess. It's it's really nice. It's got the nice veins in it. It's re I really do like it. Both of them are size 7, and uh, no way that's going to fit me. <laughs> so, uh, that's what I came up with this time. Maybe I'll do another one. I enjoyed this video. I hope you did too. Uh, if you'd like to see some more videos by me, then just click on my channel and I have some playlists. I have some videos with Paracord and knife reviews and some other miscellaneous stuff. So thanks again for watching. This has been Night 16. Night out.